One Texas television personality is renowned for her efforts in helping young children find adoptive families. However, it was six years after she played a crucial role in connecting a young boy with a loving family that he surprised her with heartfelt words that brought her to tears. In 2014, news anchor Gloria Campos was commemorating her 30-year anniversary with WFAA, a television channel based in Dallas-Fort Worth. Over the course of her illustrious career, Campos had achieved numerous milestones, becoming a local celebrity in the process. Her popularity even garnered her a substantial following of over 10,000 Twitter users. Campos began her tenure at WFAA in 1984, making her the first Hispanic anchor in the region. Throughout her career, she covered a wide range of topics, from elections to the Super Bowl. However, it was her renowned Wednesday's Child segments that left a lasting impression on people. These poignant reports featured children who were currently in foster care, eagerly awaiting adoption. The goal was to find these young individuals loving families, and Campos proved to be exceptionally skilled at this task. Over the course of 25 years presenting the feature, she shared the stories of 350 children, three quarters of whom found their forever homes through adoption. One of the children featured on Campos, Wednesday's child segment was Keont Cook. Cook appeared on the show in 2007 at the tender age of eight. This current enthusiast managed to capture the hearts of one family, but unfortunately, the subsequent adoption attempt fell through. However, Hyanta Cook's story left a profound impact on Gloria Campos, prompting her to give him a second chance on the show. So, in 2009, two years after his initial appearance, Campos featured him once more, hoping that this time he would find a loving family. During the second report, the young boy shared more of his heart-wrenching story. Tragically, his candid interview revealed the harsh realities of life in foster care. I've been moved to different homes, Cook explained, his words bearing the scars of his experiences. He went on to recount that the previous adoption attempt had not gone well. Little did he know that brighter days were on the horizon. Carol and Scott Cook, a couple who had seen the report, believed it was destiny that had led them to Chianti. They applied to adopt him, and this time, the adoption was a resounding success. Chianti moved in with his new adoptive family, complete with a loving mom and dad by his side to support him. Upon his arrival in his new home, Chianti relied on medication, which had been prescribed during his time in foster care to manage his difficulties. However, these medications left him feeling confused and emotionally unstable. His adoptive mother often found him pacing in circles in his room. With the unwavering support of his adoptive parents, Chianti gradually weaned himself off the mind-altering drugs. As a result, he rediscovered his zest for life and soon became an active and enthusiastic young boy. Within a few years, Chianti had taken up dancing, running, and hiking. In short, Keont Cook's appearance on Wednesday's Child, alongside Gloria Campos, had transformed his life in remarkable ways. Not only had he found a loving family, but he had also discovered his passions, for which he would forever be grateful. Given the opportunity to express his gratitude to Gloria Campos in person, Keont Cook eagerly seized the chance. With the assistance of WFAA, the young man surprised the news anchor live on air, resulting in an incredibly touching moment. Celebrating her 30-year tenure at WFAA, Campos had been watching a report about Cook, one of the many success stories from her Wednesday's Child segments. Moved by the segment, she shared her feelings with her colleague John Nika. It is so good to see Chianti, she remarked. He was the correct boy and so smart, John. It broke my heart when that first adoption did not go through for him. Just as she finished expressing her emotions about Cook, she felt the warmth of arms enveloping her. Turning around, she saw Cook already tightly embracing her, and she fought back tears. I can't believe it's you, she exclaimed. Overwhelmed with emotion, Campos expressed her happiness for Cook and the love he had found within his family. She thanked him for coming and conveyed her pride in his journey. However, it was Cook who had the most heartfelt words to share. I want to say to her, 
Thank you so much because you've made my life worthwhile. Coke expressed with deep sincerity. You've helped me become the person I am right now. I probably would have been worse off had you not helped me out. Cook's parents were equally grateful to Campos for bringing their son's plight to their attention. His mother conveyed their appreciation, saying, Not only did you bring us the child that God wanted us to have, and we wouldn't have seen him otherwise, but you've also helped touch millions through him being able to talk about his story. Furthermore, it became apparent that Campos' influence on Cook may have extended even further. Later in the news special, the teenager revealed his aspiration to become a broadcaster. Perhaps he would follow in the footsteps of the esteemed news anchor in the future. For now though, Keont Cook is savoring all the joys of being part of a supportive family. With a loving mother and father, he became a big brother in 2014. Thanks to Gloria Campos, he is now surrounded by loved ones, and he will forever carry a sense of gratitude for the impact she had on his life.